The point A, B, C, D, and E lie on a circle. FG is a tangent to the circle at D. If line EB is parallel to line DC, find the value of W, X, Y, and Z. Let's go ahead and solve. First we are going to start with W. To find W, let's consider triangle BDE. From the triangle BDE, line DE is a chord which has an angle of 20 degrees with the tangent. Notice that W is an angle in the alternate segment. Now, let's recall the circle theorem of the angle between the chord and the tangent. It states that, the angle between a tangent to a circle, and a chord through the point of contact, is equal to the angle in the alternate segment. From this figure, A, is the angle between the tangent and the chord, and B is the angle in the alternate segment. From the theorem, A is equal to B. This shows that W, is equal to 20 degrees. And the reason is angle in the alternate segment. Using the same theorem, we can find the angle X, because the same chord also made an angle at point A, in the alternate segment. And this angle is X and this can be observed from triangle ADE. So, we can say that X equals 20 degrees. And the reason is, angle in the alternate segment. Also, we can find X from another circle theorem. Notice that the angle X, is in the same segment with angle W. From the circle theorem of angles in the same segment, it states that angles in the same segment are equal. From this figure, A is equal to B. Because both angles are in the same segment. Also, C is equal to D, because both angles are in the same segment. Hence, we can say that X is equal to W, which is 20 degrees. And the reason is angles in the same segment. Before we proceed, if you're new to my channel, hit the subscribe button so you make sure to never miss my videos. Next, to find Y. Let's consider chord DC, notice that chord DC, also made an angle 25 degrees with the tangent, and through the chord, an angle is made at point A, which is in the alternate segment. And from the theorem of angle in the alternate segment, this shows that angle DAC, is 25 degrees. Since, line EB is parallel to line DE, then angle EBD, is equal to angle BDC, that is 20 degrees. This is because both angles are alternate angles. And alternate angles are equal. Now that we have gotten these angles, we can go ahead and find Y. From triangle ADC. Observe that. Angle ADC is equal to Y plus 20 degrees. So, we are going to find the value of angle ADC from this triangle, and this will enable us to get Y. From triangle ADC, angle ADC, is equal to 180 degrees minus, 75 degrees plus 25 degrees. Reason sum of angles in a triangle. 75 plus 25 is 100. So, 180 degrees minus 100 degrees is equal to 80 degrees. Since angle ADC is Y plus 20 degrees, we can say that. Y plus 20 degrees is equal to 80 degrees. So that, Y will be equal to 80 degrees minus 20 degrees, which is equal to 60 degrees. Going further, to find Z, notice that chord DB made an angle with the tangent. That is, 20 degrees plus 25 degrees which is 45 degrees. And through this chord, an angle is made at point E, which is in the alternate segment, and this angle is Z. Hence, from the circle theorem of angle in the alternate segment, we can say that, Z is equal to 45 degrees.
and the reason is angle in the alternate segment. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, make sure to subscribe for more.